Nationals hosting the Blue Jays. The Blue Jays are minus 176 on the money line. The Nationals are plus 148. The over under eight runs. The Nationals getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 113, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Blue Jays laying a run and a half on the run line are minus 106, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. The Nationals won today 9-3, to three, and it had nothing to do with Kikuchi. He pitched a magnificent game. They pulled him after six. They bring in the reliever in the seventh, walks a couple of batters, gives up a hit, and then gives up a three-run homer, and then it was all downhill from there. They were actually winning the game 3-1 to one when Kikuchi came out. Now, for the weather for tomorrow's game, it is supposed to be, this game is also in game danger, 59 degrees, 78% chance of rain, and 10 mile an hour winds. There's a lot of games tomorrow that have a potential for a rain out, so it's going to suck if you're going to be betting some of these games. Goswood pitched once against the Nationals last year. Five innings, three runs, three earned, they won 6-3, he struck out seven. Irvin did not pitch against the Blue Jays last year. Head-to-head, -head, the Nationals are 7-3. and three. The home team's on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 6-4. and four. The underdog is 7-3 and three on the money line. The underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 7-3. and three. There's only been one one-run game in their last 10. The over is 7-2-1, and one, and the over 8 is 7-2-1. and one. Gosman has not been having a very good season. The Blue Jays are 1-4 and four in his last five starts. He's got an ERA of 2.6, averaging 4 and 2 thirds innings pitched, 6 hits per game, 3.4 runs, 2.6 of which were earned, 3.4 strikeouts, 1.2 walks, and 84.4 pitches. For the Nationals, they are 2-3 and three as a team in Irvin's last five starts. He's got an ERA of 2.6, averaging 5 and 2 thirds innings pitched, 5.2 hits, 2.6 runs or earned runs, 4.4 strikeouts, 1 walk, and an 85.4 pitches. So you're pretty much looking at the identical pitcher for just two different teams. I am going to lean with the Nationals in this one because seemingly this season, whichever way I pick with Gosman, it's been going the other way. When I was picking with him, he was losing. I picked against him last, his last start, and he won. I'm going to take the Nationals with the money line. I'm going to take the Nationals getting the runs. I will go over, and that's provided that this game is actually going to get played. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.